with offensive tackle Matt Khalil. Matt, going into tomorrow's scrimmage, what are you looking for from the offensive line? Just coming off the ball fast, being aggressive, and uh, getting after it. Obviously, this is a young offensive line. You're replacing several key guys. Where's the chemistry level right now? Uh, I think, it's, like I've said before, it's the closest it's ever been. I, I've seen it. You know, we're really tight as a group. Um, we had a great group of freshmen come in from this last class. Um, they're working hard. Uh, you know, coming to all the, uh, us veterans for help and. Uh, I think overall as a unit, you know, we're a really tight group. You know, as a veteran, what kind of teaching have you done personally with some of the younger guys like Andre Walker? Mm -hmm. well, I mean, these younger guys, you know, they can be immature. You know, they're coming from high school. Um, they're big five stars and all that. And, I mean, getting yelled at, they're not really used to it. So, you know, you got to tell them, you know, it's in one ear, out the other. And, um, you know, just taking the coaching from all these coaches and take out all the other stuff they say to you because they really don't mean it. And, um, you know, it's just about maturing as you, as you get older. And, you know, it's about getting uh, better every day. So, I mean, I'm – Telling these young guys that, you know, just what you can you improve on every day. And, um, you know, they're really buying in and they're looking to us for help. For you this year, you're getting a lot of publicity going into the year. It's kind of uncharted territory for you. How are you handling the spotlight a little bit more going into this season? I mean, I don't really, I don't focus on that stuff. You know, I've been, same work ethic I've always had. Um, the little things I can improve on, I'm always looking for something to get better at. And, um, you know, I, I'm still the same person. I mean, that, that really hasn't affected me at all. Have you become more of a vocal leader room, uh, leader in the locker room, or is it still the same guy you've always been? Oh, yeah, definitely. I think uh, Colin and I have definitely become the vocal leaders of the offense line. I mean, last year we still had older guys, so it was a little tougher for us um, to speak up. But, I mean, it's open grounds for us, and, you know, uh, we've really took a grasp of this whole line, and uh, I think Colin and I are doing a great job. You talk about the chemistry being the best it's ever been on the line. Where do you get to a point as a unit to, to be the best you can be going into the season? What is it going to take? I mean, it's just working together and working on little things, you know, coming in extra, um, watching film, going after practice, working on little technique things, anything to get better. And, I mean, um, the, these guys are doing a great job of it. And I think as a group, you know, we're really tight.